Porridge isn't a new item by any means, but selfishly, these Try It Tuesdays are about things that I haven't tried. So, for this week's Try It Tuesday, brown sugar and cinnamon porridge. Boring, not boring, I don't know, I'll have to try. Stick around for the bloopers and the random rating I give it at the end. I could stand here and claim that I'm in my pajamas because I'm trying maybe what we would call a breakfast type food, but that would be an utter lie. I'm in my pajamas because it's a public holiday and I've done my makeup, I haven't really done much with my hair because it's a public holiday and I plan to stay in my pajamas for as long as I can. So let's just get that out of the way and done with. And yes, these are fabulous Vegemite pajamas. <laughs> Okay, as a kid growing up, I remember porridge to be like an evil thing for me. My mum had it, um, I think my brother had it, but I was just like, nah, you can keep your porridge, I don't want it. But, I don't know. I like brown sugar and cinnamon, so I'm older. Do I need fibre? Oh, do you want to hear about my fibre? Jesus Christ. But these Try Tuesdays are about trying things I haven't tried before. So regardless of whether it was the devil when I was a kid, that's kind of what piqued my interest when I walked past it. Would I like it now? So I've opened my box. We've got all these little sachets in it. If it actually smells like anything. Okay, I don't need to keep whipping that. It's pretty subtle, it's just cinnamony, which you'd expect, but yeah, it's pretty subtle. But maybe that's a good thing. It's in a bowl, half a cup of milk. Nearly spilled it trying to be cool. Microwave for 90 seconds. Okay, I've just taken it out of the microwave. It's not like it looks the most appealing or gourmet, but I assume really it's just supposed to be feeling comforting warm. <laughs> it smells nicer, like this. It says stir and then let's sit to cool, but it's quite quite hot. I'm quite hungry though. Maybe. I'm trying to film before Hubby gets up. It's just easier. I keep hearing creaks from upstairs. <laughs> I thought it would be more chunky. I don't know if you can see that. Um, and I don't know if I put too much liquid in or... Oh, I don't know. Well, you're only gonna know if you try it. Shut up, baby. There's definitely a comfort level thing here in terms of like the warmth and I'm in my jammies and it's a cold morning. That's a tick. The brown cinnamon is pretty subtle. I could have taken a bigger hit of that flavor, but it's okay. Subtle is okay. I feel like it's the kind of product that I was never going to be like, oh my God, this is amazing. A five out of five. The Reese's peanut butter ice cream moment. Oh my that was my first Try Tuesday ever. Click on the link in the card and it's a very different reaction to the porridge. <laughs> it's fine. Like, it's just fine. Like, I'll have this for breakfast and I'll happily have it for breakfast other days of the week. I might spice it up. <laughs> spice it up with some banana or something. I don't know, just to give it a little extra. Like, I'll have it again. Well, I need to because I just like... A bunch of them in the packet. If I had to phrase it, I'd say, not mind-blowing, but functional. <laughs> I feel like as you get older, functional just becomes important. No, I'm pretty sure functional was important before, but you don't rank it, so. Ranking. Mm. This is a bit harder to rank. Because again, it doesn't blow my mind, but it's functional. And it's tasty enough, like it's a bit, it's a bit boring. <laughs> I understand the reason behind it. It's a cold morning and you know, oh God, I'm so torn. I can't split the rating. Can I split the rating? Because if it was functional, you'd go five out of five. You've got a hot, warm, comforting meal that you can add things to, i.e. banana. Um, Taste-wise, but it's like super subtle and it doesn't make me go, oh, I'd probably rate that out of two. 
yeah, fine. You know what? This is this is my channel. This is my daggy videos. So I'm going to give it two gum nuts out of five for like flavor and reaction, and five or four. Don't get too excited. I'll go four gum nuts out of five for functionality. It's quick. It's easy. It's tasty enough. It's comforting. I think that speaks for itself. Thanks for watching. Fun fact, the soup spoon when I was a kid was my best friend. I used it for everything and I hated, hated these shape spoons. Now it's the other way around. I don't know. I don't get it. Porridge. But nope, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. Because as a kid, no. Nah. I could stand here, lean here, lean here. I feel like Oh my god, give me more.